So we've got the Prem Team of the Season and we have got Team of the Season, Douglas Luis. He's coming in as an Aston Villa centre mid. Shocked to see another one. Obviously, we had McGinn last week and he is a 91 centre mid. He has got himself a triple play star plus, which is lovely. He's got intercept, pinged pass and Traveller alongside a four star, four star with some pretty decent stats. When we come to the team of the season as well, these are not live, so these do not upgrade. This is just what he is. Now, in terms of different uh, objectives we've got to do, play 10 matches with a minimum of three Brazilian players. Very nice. We then get assist a goal with midfielders in five separate, win seven with five Premier League, and score five finesses, and that's it. So it's not bad at all. We've obviously got the free Brazil, five Prem, and then it's just assisting and scoring. No actual requirements in there. So in terms of what we'd look at there, let's go. Well, to be fair, if you're doing the cup, you could do... No, you can't because you've got to do it in squad battles or rivals. So if we was to go into my top squad, that's not my top squad. Which one is... Is it team? That doesn't look about right either. That looks like I was trying to do an objective. So... If I would, who was who is actually my team? So we go Varan, Vidic. We've got uh, normally I go Rolfo there. In fact, so Ashley Cole at left back. Then obviously we have Drogba up front. I think yeah, Drogba. And then we have got Ronaldinho on the left or Coman potentially. So I need Brazilians, which I've got Ronaldinho. So that's one. I need two more. Then we also need the five Prem. We've got one, two. We've got two Prem at the moment. Anybody on the bench? No, I didn't think so. We can obviously change Reese James as well. Let's go for Brazilians. Who have we actually got? I could go with a loan of Allison. That's not a problem. I haven't looked at the team of the season either. So I, obviously I could go with them as well. So let's just go him in there. We will swap. In fact, I've already got a right back that's there. So we'll have to go with Pedro. We need one more Brazilian at the minimum. So we'll go with... Uh, I don't particularly want to go with her as a striker. So I'm going to have to go. We'll go João Pedro. Why not? We'll go a bit of, a bit of Pedro. That will obviously give me the Brazilians. Then I've got one, two, three, four. I need one more Premier League player. And then that should be everything. At least then we can just grind out the rest. It shouldn't be too much of an issue. We will go, we'll go Carvalho instead of Vidic for the moment. And that should do it. That should give me everything I need. The five Premier there. We've got the three Brazilians as well. That one should be not a problem whatsoever. So then what I would do to get this done as quick as possible, the 10 matches is just going to be having to play 10 matches as standard. I'd be looking to try and assist a goal with the midfielder straight off the bat every single match for the first five. Then obviously score the five goals using finesse i would as soon as i've got the assist with the midfielder i can try and take them out they can be done in one game if you really wanted to so then you could do the five finesse you then get the midfielders ones done at, after the five matches obviously winning the seven should hopefully come in the first 10 matches hopefully that is an easy way to do and that's all you've got to do it's a relatively easy objective again they've nothing's really too difficult about these they are very very standard to do but he does look a decent card at least he's got the triple play star plus i know he can't be upgraded but potentially potential evolutions later on down the line we've did we have seen a live team of the season upgrade so whether we see a prem one as well will be very interesting but that's all it is let me know how you get on